It's October 19th, I'm in Maine, and I just slipped these two gorgeous little garters. Woo! -hoo! There you go, buddy. This one's a little bit chubbier, I think. Beautiful. Found a snake two, three days ago, and I thought that was gonna be the last snake. Uh, and then I found a, a snake yesterday, and I thought that was gonna be the last snake, and it was not. Um, so, who knows at this point. I, I think it's mostly gonna be garters, though. That's kind of the only thing I could see at this point. It's about 60, 61 degrees outside right now, and we're gonna see what we can find in this stream. It's so very much fall, it's crazy. I wish it was, uh, st there's definitely a salamander in there. Where's he gone? I think that was probably just a two-lined. I've never seen anything but a two-lined in the streams here. It is indeed a little two-lined. Cutie patootie. Here you go, bye-bye. Another one. Hello, little guy. So I'm, I'm gonna um, be looking around for a bunch of salamanders. After this, I'm gonna go look for duskies. Um, I'm sure I'll see some uh, red backs, probably some other two lines at that place. And then after that, I'm gonna quickly go and check for some blue spotteds and see if I can get you guys a bunch of cool fall amphibians uh, before winter takes over everything. That's interesting. You don't normally see uh millipedes in super duper wet environments but this guy is literally in the stream strange man what a gorgeous little two-lined here pretty little guy put him back in the stream doo, doo, doo. damn he's fast yeah. hello no you can't i, got, I don't want to smush you i lift the whole rock out my little friend that's that's fine. Just gotta put the rock back. I love stream salamanders. What a beauty. You? Yep. Woo! I love them. They're so, they're so spastic. I realize why would I be here if I could be at the other place that has all the same things that are here and duskies. So I'm gonna head over there now. I am here at the second spot. Just getting dark, which is good. I mean, for what I'm looking for right now, I don't really, it's not really gonna matter, but um, duskies, I have seen duskies out like at night, so I, I might have a higher chance of seeing them out. I've been here before, um, a little bit earlier in the year, and we've had some rejuvenation from the, the dry spell. I mean, it's still, we're still in a horrible drought, but last time I was here, the stream was entirely dried up, pretty much, except like very low level areas. Um, pretty much the entire stream was dried up last time I was here. Still found tons of duskies, but there was no water in the stream. I'm wondering if there'll be a little bit more moisture in the area this time, because it's a little bit later in the year and we've gotten a little bit more rain. My stream! Hello, my friends! It's a dusky time. Apparently it's still redback time, but we got two gorgeous little redbacks here. One and two. Got to get them out from underneath this log because when I put it back, I don't want to smush them. There you go, guys. Yeah, well, we got some duskies. There's one here. Okay, well, there's a second one. At least a second one. Where'd he go? There he is. I got two gorgeous dusky salamanders. Uh, this one's actually pretty big, too. So pretty. Hi, buddy. Gorgeous. These are some absolutely fantastic salamanders. I have not seen too many duskies in my life. This is the spot where I have found all of, almost all of my duskies except one. Uh, so I don't have too much like variation um, and stuff like that. But I don't care. These guys are gorgeous and I love them and they're just so cool. What a, what a cute little boy. Hi. Okay, there you go. And you too. I really love dusky salamanders. I really don't have too many salamanders where I am. Or, I mean, I have a lot of salamanders, low diversity of species. I wish I had some other species around here. It'd be quite nice. Dusky number three, yeah. under this little rock right here. Very, very pretty. How are we doing today, buddy? This one has a nice, uh, uh, much, much lighter pattern. Light enough that you can actually see the pattern a little better than the other two I just found. A lot of these ones that are really stuck in the ground aren't gonna probably aren't going to have any of them. Oh, oh, a baby dusky. He's so small. I don't know if I've ever seen a dusky this small that's not, you know, larval. 
This is a little baby dusky. Gorgeous. It's a big red back. Hey, buddy. Wow, you're a fat one. Good grief. This one looks like he's re recently uh, regrown his tail, which is great. He's big, he's fat, he's regrown his tail. That's a healthy guy right there. They already lost count of the duskies, but here's another dusky. Probably, I don't know, I, I guess number four or five. Hello, my friend. Gorgeous. And I had planned to come back here at night, too, um, just to see if I could see the duskies out and about hunting. But because there's still no water in this stream, they're... I mean, they will be out and about, I guess, but it won't be in the way that I had wanted, which is fine, but I'll go down lower in the stream when I leave because there is water down there. There's not that much of it. There might be some guys on the move, which would be really, really cool to see. Oh, there's a red back. Goodness, I just destroyed your home. I'm sorry, sir. I will put it back together. Oh, there's another red back, actually. Right. Whoop! My little one. Gorgeous. Big boy and little boy. There you go. You can't go in here. I gotta put the rock back there. Oh, damn. That looks like a two lines. That was a gorgeous two line. That is a... Whoa. Oh, I remember this now. This place had gorgeous two lines, didn't it? God, he's moving fast. Uh, hi. Let's try to get a good look here. Oh, my. What a gorgeous little mander. Hello. Oh, you're so cute. Ooh wee. Oh, at least you. Going into your rock you came from. That's a real cool find. I knew they would be here, but I forgot how pretty they are here. Gorgeous little red back. How you doing, buddy? You're not gonna be smushed by this rock, so I'm just gonna put it right back on you. What a small rock to be under, little guy. I also expect to see these guys just kind of out in the uh, leaf litter too. Uh, I just brushed back one little bit of leaf litter and there was this man under it. Uh, this is not surprising at all. This is kind of what it, where I'm going to find the uh, blue spotted later on, uh, later on in the night and hopefully pretty soon actually. Oh my gosh, what is this? There's a microscopic salamander right here. That looks to be a baby dusky. God, he's so small. I have to whip out my macro lens for him. Oh goodness, it's so cute. Look at that little thing. Yeah, I think that's a dusky. Of course, I could be wrong, but that pattern does look pretty dusky to me. And notice there's a lot of duskies here. That's so silly. He's so small. Oh my gosh. All right, I'm not in the stream right now, but I had to come up here and flip this log. Oh, look at this gorgeous lead back. My gosh. What a pretty man. Literally glowing green. Redback salamanders have a lot of variation. Like enough variation that in some places that would be like multiple different species. Uh, I've seen many species that look as similar as redback variants look to each other, if you get what I'm saying. I just flipped this absolutely gorgeous dusky. Again, I'll put it up on the screen, but I don't know what number dusky this is. Gosh, what a pretty, pretty salamander. Yeah, I just flipped these two little redbacks next to them. I gotta get these out of here with one hand. How, do, how am I gonna do that? How, how, I gotta... Come on, folks, come on. Come on, move it, move it. Okay, it's entirely dark. I have turned back um, and I'm gonna check downstream for maybe some other duskies. See if I could see any uh, duskies or stream salamanders actually out and about doing their thing in the stream. That's always cool to see. I spy with my little eye, a stream salamander. Oh goodness, where's he going? I'd like to catch him. It's a little too lined, gorgeous. Oh, he's leaving again. Oh, I might've lost him, good grief. Oh my gosh, I almost stepped on this man. I'm sorry, sir. You have a good night. Oof. All right, I am at the third spot. I'm at the blue spotted spot. I hope we see, there's definitely millipedes out, um, but I gotta be a little more quiet here because it's near a big population center. People are always walking through here and um, I don't wanna be weird. I must act normal. I mean, act normal to an extent. I'm still in like a culvert with a headlight on so i guess i don't know why i'm even trying at this point interestingly enough i know i kind of mentioned this earlier but this is the same culprit that i found my uh my life for dusky salamander i got a red back hi little man like i, I don't think i've ever seen a blue spotted here without a red back or a 
I guess mostly redbacks, but the redbacks definitely have the highest biomass around here. Or maybe not biomass, definitely highest number. I don't know, man. Yellow spotted's are pretty, pretty juicy. There's another one. Hello, my friend. How do you do? A little fellow. Got even more redbacks here. Got one there, and a slightly larger one up here. There's a beautiful gray right there. Nice. Fantastic. Not a blue spotted yet, but a four toed. What a gorgeous little salamander. I love seeing these guys. And this is the time of year that I do see them here, which is kind of funny. Uh, they just they just be walking around. It's very strange how, how uh, salamanders work. I don't know, they confuse me. Unfortunately, with this drought this year, everything is a lot drier than it was last year. So there just is a lot less amphibians about, but they're still here. I mean, it's not like it was wet last year either. It just was a little bit more wet. So although this year might not be as good as like last year was, um, hopefully if, if we get a good amount of rain the next couple of months, hoping that that will lead to seeing some epic, epic salamanders around here. Also mink frogs. I want to show you guys some mink frogs. Love mink frogs. And boom, I was just about to leave and I got exactly what I wanted. A gorgeous blue spotted salamander. They don't get as big as yellow spotted. Um, they get like to a similar length, I think. I think they can get pretty long, but they're definitely a lot skinnier um, proportionally compared to the yellow spotted. Gorgeous. Oop. All right, he was coming across this way, so I got a wrong direction, sir. I got to move you off the road, my friend. There you go, buddy. Dirty fellow. He'll, he'll, he'll clean himself off through those leaves, but brought him across the road so he won't get hit by a car or me when I'm leaving. That is amazing blue spotted right there. Chubby one. Gorgeous. Very nice. It was like under this rock. I stepped on it. Not the salamander, the rock. It's so gorgeous. Oh my gosh. This place really has a quite healthy population of blue spotted. I'm, I'm such a, I'm so happy that I just like randomly like found this place. Beautiful. Quite magnifique. Indeed.